Welcome to RimWorld Multiplayer Mod, version 4.0, third attempt, fourth attempt, fifth attempt, however many attempts we're on. It's not very stable, we'll admit, so we've disabled all of the mods and we're playing a base game reward experience, but you can suggest some mods to add to the mod pack as we play along. Hopefully, we'll over time build up something that's more interesting. I'm joined by the most interesting person of all, myself, and I've decided to bring along Joshk. Hello, Joshk. Hello. So, have you played RimWorld Multiplayer before, Joshk? Uh, I, I've dabbled. You've dabbled. I think we've both dabbled. I think dabbled yeah. is about all we've fucking done in this goddamn mod. Um, so, for those eagle-eyed of you out there, you can see Josh is a disembodied mouse. You can see what he clicks on. You can see as he does things. You can see as he builds things. You see that? Just selected some meals there. It's the future. It's the future of RimWorld, anyway. So... <gasps> There's a chinchilla. Uh, chim chimini, chin chimini, chin chin chari. There he is. Next, next to the panther, so I think he's uh, about to get fucked. His days but... are numbered. So, um, we've got two characters, which were randomly generated this time. I did build some characters before, but they're randomly generated this time. So, do you want to go through them quickly when they've landed? Let's let them land first. And then I'll let you talk about me first, because I'm first on the list. Okay, so, we have Samsk, the edgelord. That's me. Hello. Uh, who is okay at shooting. Uh-huh. Fairly good at melee, yep. and has mining and plants, and is a... How can you be slothful and a fast learner? That doesn't really make sense. I don't know. Uh, okay. <laughs> You're also 48 years old. Yeah, Chat. that was the only downside to that guy. Whereas I basically can only do intellectual. Yeah, but you've got... Right. Uh, I'm also abrasive. Sounds about right. Uh, all those traits sound about right. <laughs> <laughs> you've got intellectual, which is good. You've got a massive passion in mining as well. So if we just set you to work in a quarry, you're going to get good very, very quickly. Um, my character only has a passion in melee, but he's more round wounded. Uh, more well, sorry. Oh, he... well wounded. <laughs> Band. He has plants, <laughs> which was important. He has plants and mining, whereas you have intellectual. So between us, we've got our. Oh shit! Do we have a cook? Cooking oh, two. No. Cooking zero. Yay! And we're in the middle of a swamp. I figured we'd go for a hard start, seeing as we're just playing base game remote here. So we're in the middle of a swamp. It's warm. It's it's dank. It's moist and very humid. Um, but more less about Josh, more about the swamp. Am I right? <laughs> so. <laughs> if you guys have any topics for discussion during these boring few early episodes where we don't get any other characters, then please, for the love of God, let me know, and we will uh, we'll talk about whatever you want to talk about. I've got a really good question that we definitely not brought up before, and I'll try and think of some others as we go along. Um, Josh, if you've got any. That will make for good old, good old topics of talk. Oh my god, there's so little. There's, I forgot what base game removal was like. This is horrible. So, like I said, we'll introduce more mods as we play. But we did have a fairly sizable mod pack. Um, which was not working. Let's put it that way. We tried with me hosting, Josh coasting. Um, get out of here. Give me that Give me that rifle. Who's the best shot, actually? Because they should probably take the rifle. I got shooting seven. Uh... Oh, you got shooting four. Big shit. All right. Do you want to take this knife? Oh, that monkey is so annoying. No, you've got the better. You've got better melee, mate. Oh, we have a pet monkey. We have a pet monkey. So if you get lonely during the long nights, um, um full swear. Yeah. That's how diseases happen, mate. Any diseases in particular, like the common cold, is what you're thinking of. Yeah, totally. We need to also get the stuff out of the river because stuff in a river tends to decay very, very quickly. Yeah. Um, so let's get this uh, medicine and silver out of there. Pretty. Oh my god. How do you designate things to be hauled? Some items are always haulable and can't be designated. You can. Pri you can do prioritize hauling. You can't. That's that's a mod. No. Right click. Prioritize hauling. Oh right, right, sure, yeah. yeah. Um, you silly you bitch. Can do that. I thought you meant the the haul urgently mod, um, or the allow tool mod that allows you the ability to haul things urgently. Okay. Well, this is good. This is a nice little uh, base game RimWorld start. So, uh, water wheels? Uh, yes? <laughs> oh my god, it's just occurred to me we're in a fucking swamp, so this is not going to be easy to build on, is it? Oh. Uh, oh, fuck. There's so little in base game RimWorld. Ah. How do we build that? There's so little room to build on. <laughs> Oh, I've never played in a swamp before. This might have been a really difficult playthrough accidentally. What you do is you chop wood. Yes, we chop wood. And we're going to do something like... Cut plants. There we go, that would do. Um, it's not much. Do cutting plants rather than chopping wood. 
I'm doing both, mate. I mean, that would take out all the grass as well. You can just chop wood, you know. Yeah, but some of the stuff you have to clear, anyway. Yeah, but we're not going to be building over there. We're building here, by the rhinos. Why not cancel it? We're building by the rhinos. Um, so we want to actually kind of build a little bit closer to the river. I think we should be drug barons. I think that should be the goal of this campaign, to be to be deep in the jungle drug barons. So if I open up the world map here, um, we're in Fen, Grey Chimpanzee. That's the name of this Fen that we are deep in. Um, there are some nearby people we can trade with. We've got uh, Saragossa, which we could potentially send some drug caravans over. They're natives nearby, tribal natives. They love drugs. We could ruin their society with drugs and alcohol, huh? That sounds good. Maybe some casinos too. <laughs> what? You sound... Sound like that's not oh the dear, best idea oh I've ever come up with. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Speaking of oh dear, oh dear, I posed you a question while we're in the while we're in the ball <laughs> <laughs> while we're in the boring early game, as I said before. Um, I posed you a question and to help pass the time while we were building things and recruiting some colonists. What? Mm -hmm. Okay, so so it's it's a hypothetical. What three video game characters would you like uh, a a consensual relationship with? Um, Specifically video game characters. Jennifer Vengerberg. Vengerberg? No, that's, <laughs> no, 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 that's the fact you're thinking of the Venger boys. No, I'm pretty sure she's Jennifer Vengerberg. What is it? Uh, yeah, Vengerberg. Oh, oh is it? Does she yeah. know the Venger boys? <laughs> Probably. Um, Femship and... I don't like how quickly you've got the answers prepared this time. I need to throw you a curve. I need to get you a different question. I need to throw you a curve. <laughs> it's almost like I've had this question before. How is it already dark? Um, we're in a swamp. Axial tilt. I don't know. I've got <laughs> no answer to that one. Um, it's the trees. It's the canopy. It makes it look dark. Now, one thing we should... You know, last time we, we came up with this big plan, oh, let's get water wheels and shit. You know what we really, really need this time? We need uh, whatever it's called. Pumping, water pumping, ground pumping. What's it called? Excuse me? Speaking of Jennifer of, of Vengerberg, we need moisture pumps. There we go. Um, so they can actually use the ground and, and use it, turn it useful, right? So Surely we need electricity for those. We do. We need a lot of electricity as well. So that's. So we should get water mills. Water mills water. to power pumps so that we've actually got usable land to build on, I think is not a bad plan. We can't even farm in these areas because it's just that fucking dense with with moisture maybe we can farm rice rice is probably not a bad shout are you going for probably. a walk see you later we should probably check up set up like jobs and shit as well um oh there's so few jobs this is so strange um oh my god we don't have a good doctor our I'm best so doctor fucked. is skill three good this is when we get the plague and immediately die um you're an okay warden so took some points into that Oh my god, we're both terrible cooks. Phenomenal. Um, that can be your number one job. Growing can be mine. Constructing will both take a little bit of uh, work for. Hunting should be maximum priority, I think. Plant cutting should also be maximum priority. Mining will put kind of low. Do you, do you agree with what I'm doing in this jobs tab? Uh, yes. I didn't even look, but yes. <laughs> I think we'll go like that. I think that's fine. Yeah, this, this early research might be a bad, bad shout. How good is my character at research? He's not. For fuck's sake. Tra what does Sloth will do? Oh my god. Global work speed minus 35. Oh shit, the bed. That's so bad. <laughs> um, good. How good this happened to me? This is what we get for not having prepared carefully enabled. Should we try speed 3? Is it, is it, is it worth it? Yeah, smash it. Alright, I mean we've got nothing <laughs> enabled, so if it, if it fucks up now, this is, uh, this is an internet based fault. Oh, a goods trader. They're making their way through the the thickets, through the jungle there. They've got cows. Um, making their way downtown. Is it worth buying cows, do you think? Walking fast on a homebound. I want a cow. Please buy it. Look at that. They're making... Okay, so this is actually running pretty well. When we've got no mods enabled. Weird, that. Um, right, so we can't put down a floor in that room you're in now. Because uh, it's all swamp. Yeah, like It's actually wet ground. So we're going to have to pump it all first before we can lay some pipe. Um, Ooh, well, pump me. Trade with Rala. I'm going to trade with Rala and see what they've got. My friend, sell me your cow. Do you want to buy a cow? Does that pause it when I'm trading? Uh, yes. Ah, okay. Um, they've got 
Can you see the trading screen? You can! I see. Stop buying the... Do we want to buy the bull? Um, I mean, of, of the cow variants, a bull is not that useful. Well, we could buy a bull and a cow. <laughs> the cow variants. <laughs> we could buy a bull and a cow. That might have not be a bad idea. I mean, I feel like we don't want to waste our money at the moment. Well, what because else there's are we plenty gonna spend of things. Yeah, but we might want to save it for later. We're in the middle of a fucking swamp. It's not like we can just pop down to the co-op. <laughs> How's the roof coming along? Are we are we roofed? Um, we are we are roofed. Excellent, good work, team. Uh, even though is that soil like? Oh, we got rich soil. Oh, it's rich soil everywhere. So our crops are going to grow pretty decently. Good, nice. I like it. Okay. Um, how are we supposed to get food this early on? I've got. Um, I mean, we've got... literally planting rice. I mean, there's loads of things we can kill. Like monkeys! Hunt the monkeys! Do I want to I hunt mean, the monkeys? Th there's also a load of boar. Boars will fuck you up, though, if you fail. We need to go hunt something that's a bit more passive. Let's not do that, then. Um, what about cassowaries? What are they like? Cassowaries, 10% chance to attack if they're harmed, so they're one of the highest Alpacas? The uh, alpacas, no, they won't harm you back. So let's go hunt some alpacas. Let's hunt some orc. There we go. Good work, team. We're big game hunting. I've, uh, I've hunt chinchillas? Winged one. There doesn't seem any sport in that. I hate to say it. <laughs> yes, I'm hunting these chinchillas with a hammer. <laughs> with my plastic knife. <laughs> there we go. Good work, uh, There's team. also some package survival meals, which I can't... You can't hunt those. They're not alive. <sighs> uh-huh. Well, I think we need to get a... Should we get the research set up as soon as possible? So do we want to get that water generator? I mean, it's all, it's almost like I've done that. Uh, I mean, you haven't. It wasn't on the list of research. Uh, I think you'll find it was. Uh, oh, no. I think you'll find it wasn't. I, th I think you'll find it was. That's fine. I've put it on the queue anyway. So we'll, we'll, we'll just wait for that to desync in a second then. Um, do you want a chair? Oh, dear, oh dear. I'm feeling generous. Would you like a chair? Now, what a stool, mate. Yeah. Oh, okay, fine. Stool. Boom, there you go. It's better for your back, apparently. It's better for I your do, spine. I, I do stool. like a nice bit of stool. I bet what? you do. Does Jennifer and the younger boys bring you that? Sorry? Yeah. Jennifer and the Jenga boys. <laughs> Is that all the rice you could afford to plant? Are we on a budget or something? Are you like... I was just like doing a small amount because there's other stuff we need to do right now. Rice plants in about two seconds. Nah, 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 nah. Good lord. We're going to have some real problems in this colony. When I'm back from hunting, what did we do with those last two alpaca we hunted? We just leave them around to rot. We just left them on the floor. For fuck's sake. Um, Us, do we have a stockpile to put them anywhere? We should do, because I haven't altered the other one. Nope. Because uh, it wasn't set to corpses. Prioritize hauling, right? There you go. I've got those two being hauled, because otherwise it's just an absolute waste. Um, what about the other ones? Just make sure we don't let any al uh, alpaca go to waste, because they're, like, pretty decent. Mainly because mainly they don't attack Badger and Selling him. Oh, there's also bushes, like blueberry bushes we could go and grab. Those also won't attack back. <laughs> I don't know, they can be quite dangerous. It's alright, you're used to little pricks. Um, how did that what? put? There's a dead person over there. Where? We're cannibals! No, we're not. Oh, we're not. We could be <laughs> cannibals. <laughs> how did that guy die? How did that guy fun? die? Mog? Uh, Rice Link. Oh, the trader caravan. They had a fight. Bow. Get, get his bow. Go get his bow. Pemimican. 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 We should allow the Pemimican because that will last quite a long time. 23 Pemimican. Spoils in 1.1 years and we've left it out in the swamp. So that should tell you how good Pemimican is. I kind of want a rhino pet. <laughs> good luck with that. Major break risk. Oh, calm down. Are we already up that stage? Oh my Almost god. Almost just because I'm tired. Recreation deprived. Uh, nah, nah, nah. Awful barrack. I mean, I can't argue wah, with that. Wah, wah. Um, shall I build two bedrooms? What difficulty do we have it on? Uh, Randy Roth. Why do you have it on Randy? Because <laughs> I thought we needed a challenge. Because we're playing in the base game room world. Right. I'm going to build some bedrooms. You go about your business, because the last thing we need right now is a mental breakdown during these these early, early hours. There we yeah, because we don't want to restart this yet again. Oh, yeah, God forbid we should restart this video game. Um, there we go. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Get some doors tripped down as well. There we go. It's very, very easy to keep their mood up with all of these different furniture mods we've got enabled. Oh, hang on a second. 
There's a problem with How that, isn't there? How could this happen to me? We don't, we don't have any furniture mods anymore. Shit. Um, we should probably set them some recreation time, otherwise they're going to freak out. Um, like, should, should I go two hours at the end of the night? Yep. That would do it. Josh and Sam can have their recreation time. Cutting bush. Isn't that the truth? Right, go and... Uh, um, what? <laughs> go and... Uh, s who's good at constructing? Neither of us. Oh, my God. Um... We could both prioritize constructing right now. That might not be a terrible plan. Because that's a, a bit more immediately useful, I'd say, than research. Can you stop yeah. researching and help me build the bedrooms, goddammit? <laughs> so annoying. What was the point in hunting those alpacas? They're just going to rot before we do anything with them. <laughs> Typical... Oh, we don't even have room fridge, fuck's sake. No, we don't have room fridge. We have nothing. This is the base game now. We're... Can we add room fridge back in? Because I know that's not going to break it. <laughs> well, you can't guarantee that. <laughs> From... oh, Look, we'll slowly... Thing, we'll introduce... How about this? Two mods per episode. That way we also have to pick very carefully what mods we want to add back. So I think rim that adds fridge. another layer of strategy to it. Rim fridge. What do you think? Like, <laughs> rim fridge and vegetable garden maybe we should add first? Uh, I don't think we need vegetable garden yet. Okay. Okay. I see. Okay. I've got a bed. Oh, no, we're going to have to share tonight. We're going to have to share tonight. I'm sorry. Um, uh... that, panther's, that panther just ate all of the pemmican. <laughs> that panther just ate every last bit of pemmican rather than the dead dude next to it. Oh, God. Okay, yeah, so that, uh, that I kind of like. So we'll add two mods per episode uh, until we've got a nice equilibrium but then it also like i said adds that layer of strategy where we can add like quality of life we can add things that are going to help out you know as the series progresses 69 raw meat can we make pemmican at this stage of the game or do we have to research it i think we have to research it oh fuck first things first kibble. psychoid brewing oh we could eat kibble but we won't apparently people don't like to eat kibble for some reason weak we could eat anna the monkey um I mean, there's. I think swamps have a lot of animals spawn in them. Yeah, they, so they really, really do. I think we'll be fine. We've got shit tons of rats and chinchillas and monkeys and tortoise and cassowary and three panther. Panthai? I don't think that's the right plural. I'm pretty sure it's just plant panther. And also. Panthosaurus? No, still not right. <laughs> I've, I want to. Okay, so I think we should vote on mods to add for the first episode. Um. So your vote, your your mod is room fridge. You'd like to put that forward for consideration. Yeah. Okay. A uh, motion carried. Cool. Uh, I would like to add. Let me let me open up the the mod list and or, or at least. How the are you on edge? Recreation stuff for fuck's sake. Yeah, I'm sad. Jesus, deal oh, with it, my fine. friend. Um, Keep are about to flip the shit out. I would like to add. Let me take a look here. Uh. Uh, and I'll put a link to the full collection that we were going to play with. And then you guys can sort of critique as... What about Nature is Beautiful? Living in a swamp, that might help out a lot. Uh, might do. Uh, maybe the quarry, but I feel like the quarry is not going to be relevant for a while yet. No, we don't need that yet. Um, run and gun. Don't need that yet. Uh, tilled soil. The, the swamp's fertile anyway. Not where you planted that rice, it's not. No, 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 no. Um, also, tilling the soil is better than fertile soil. Oh, well, fishing, fishing. I don't think f food and meat is going to be a problem. Okay. Um, Glitter world, no. Um. <laughs> uh, Brimsnell. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm in a daze. I feel like, we look, I'm just saying, uh, if we had Nature is Beautiful turned on, like, I probably wouldn't be in a daze because his mood would be higher because it's so beautiful out here in the swamp. No, uh, extra... Recreation things. Oh, additional joy objects. Yeah, boy. Okay, that's fine. So, so we'll we'll enable. So, what did we say? Additional joy objects and rim fridge. No stacks. Stack increase. You want stacking? What ogre stack or something? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. No. Because I... I can't stand small stacks. Okay. Fine. So we'll enable ogre stack, um, and we will enable rim fridge. It's all then. ogre now. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> we'll enable that and then obviously look we know we can play on speed 3 in the base game safely and we'll just keep chucking mods until eventually it breaks and then we've also got a good knowledge of what is that you've got there oh floors I see um, 
That way, we've also got a good knowledge of which mods we can uh, we we can take out if we've got an issue with it. I think this is a good idea. I like it. My guy is really not too sad, huh? What what's wrong? Ravenously hungry, awful barrack, which we're going to solve in a second. Drowsy, so they need a few more hours sleep. That's easily fixable as well. Um, so let's do this then. Sleep, wreck. There we go. So now they're actually getting they're getting nine hours of sleep. So I don't know why they need. Oh, that's it. Put a plant pot in there. That'll Stop him having a mental breakdown, you fucking idiot. <laughs> Here's a plant pot, because that's what we need, Josh. More fucking plants around us. <laughs> good, good. Did I did I mention the bit where people can just give us some topics and we'll talk about it during these like downtime hours? Where we're just waiting for people to sleep and shit, and waiting for stuff to be built. Yeah, give us those. Give us topics, and we'll uh, we'll discuss some stuff. I'll try and come up with some more hypotheticals before next time, because um, I like that hypothetical. It's just if you, if it's better if you don't already know what we're going to ask. It kind of defeats the point, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, wh who's your favorite? Who are your top three? Here's a good question. Curveball. Uh, top three favorite Nazis. Go. <laughs> um. <laughs> don't actually don't actually answer that one. <laughs> But that's the type of thing we need, right? We just need we just need random spontaneous, you know, <laughs> questions about Nazis. No, no, no. The Nazis is is actually not encouraged at all. Um, what are your two you... favorite countries that harbored Nazis? Argentina and Brazil. Why are you building? <laughs> why are you building floors before we've got another friggin' bed? I, f I didn't prioritize the fucking build order, mate. What is wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> Great. Okay, we've got three squares of floor. Meanwhile, I'll just go and sleep amongst the fucking stars. <laughs> My guy's exhausted, apparently. This is if wandering around in a swamp for 24 hours wouldn't do that to a person. Um, the rice is almost grown, so that's a pretty good start. Um, or some of it is grown. I've collapsed. Uh, I've, I've collapsed due to extreme exhaustion. I'm coming home to harvest the rice. There we go. All right. Um, should we build just like a regular old powered furnace to start off with? What are they called? Stove. Uh, Powered stove. Stove. Uh, fuel... A wind turbine. <gasps> Build a wind turbine on top of the fucking rice farm. Okay. That's a good plan. I like that one. Well done. Um, Bam. He's putting it there. I agree. That's a, that's a good place. That's a good place. And we'll expand the rice farm out to cover its... Um... And we can make a, a mini fridge. Yes. A, a mini fridge. Did you ever have a mini uh, fridge, Josh? Uh-oh. What? Yeah, I did. Did you? Of course yeah. you would. Yeah, I'm not surprised. My parents would let me have one. Now I, now I've got a real fridge. They can't stop me. What is that you're building there? Is that the freezer? Yeah. Oh, okay. There you go. So I've expanded the rice farm to actually cover the entire base of the, uh, of the windmill. Um, rice also takes a long time to spoil too, so this has worked out pretty well. Um, corn is the best base game. That's the chaos crop. gods. No. What? No, that's not. <laughs> no crop. Best crop. Um, oh, yeah. yep. Most nutritional crop, uh, based on like time to grow and yield, average expected yield. I did some maths during the Eagle Throog campaign. Yeah, I did see. So let's let's, let's grow us some corn once we've got the like the. Oh, we should probably replace the rice stock with corn when we've got enough rice to last us a while. I think. Um, obviously, the downside of that is we get blighted. It takes a long time to grow. Then we'll be fucked. So, what do you think of multiplayer Rimworld, Josh? Is it everything you'd imagined and more? I mean, it's everything I imagined, but less, because there aren't mods. <laughs> like regular Rimmel, but worse in every way, because there's less content. Yeah, you're not wrong. Yep. <laughs> oh, there goes all of our alpaca meat. I think we just did that for sport. Yeah. Somewhere Michael Jackson's screaming between two trees. Oh, that one's okay. That one's going to last a while. Oh, no, spoils in 0 0.3. Nine seconds. Goodbye, alpaca meat. Well, that was not a senseless waste of life or anything. Why is that not spinning? Blocked by Cypress Hill. What are they doing here? Get out of here. Um, is that what, these things? What? Maple tree? Where's a cypress tree? Oh, that one there. Okay, well, we just got to wait for the, the actual rice suit farm to finish off. Let me just finish off my wood floors in my bedroom first. Hey, idiot. Finish the bed? That's probably a better idea. Oh, hang on. He's, he's <laughs> too busy doing that. Yeah, we'll just go prioritize cutting some wood here. Um, oh, you know what? Let's prioritize cutting that one in particular so we can actually start the wind turbine. <laughs> You don't start with batteries anymore in Rimworld, do you? Uh, nope. That's horrible. That's a terrible decision. I don't know why they've done that. Um, let's get... um we should also probably move the yep. 
da, 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 what's it called? Medicine indoors before it deteriorates. Uh, yeah, absolutely not a bad plan at all. I'm doing it now. Is this a? Oh, this is a stop power zone, is it? Right, let's do that. Um, just sort of do something like that. I mean, it's not really a big deal. Construction botched. I beg your fucking pardon. Was that the bed? Oh no, thank God. I was gonna say if we botched the construction of the bed, that would oh, suck. Hang on, hang on. I can catch this fuck. Fuck's sake. Cancel the floors. I need a bed. <laughs> no, 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 no. I need a bed, please. No. Right. Prioritize constructing. Here. Get rid of that. There you go. Let's force them to use their actual beds. Nice. Okay. Oh, there we go. Saved it. Everybody's happy now. No problems. Uh, the wind turbine. I'm happy. <laughs> wind turbine's still not working, but that's fine. Um, should probably set that to actually be minus nine. Uh, does that work on your screen? The temperature going down. It should do, but I'm just... Oh, well, it hasn't got enough power now. That's fine. That's good. This has been a successful Do we want to put battery before watermill? Actually, no. Watermill is constant power, so it should be fine. Yeah, it, it shouldn't really matter. We, we do want to definitely store some eventually. Um, the only downside is we've got a diagonal river, which is a real, real pain in the ass building watermill nah, generators on. it's not that difficult. Yeah, no, it, it is. It's a pain nah. in the ass. No, it is a real... If if you're just not a scrub, it's fine. No, it is a real pain in the ass though compared to a vertical or, hor or horizontal river. Um, uh... The farm's on fire. <laughs> <laughs> uh, everything's on fire, Josh. <laughs> Episode one, everything burns. That's a good start. Uh, block my maple tree still. There we go. Right. Let's get let's get the plant sowed. Let's get the farm sowed, and then we're uh, we're done basically. I thought you were just chopping that chinchilla then. I want to tame it. Can we have a pet? I feel like it'd be good for morale. Um, something just got ripped apart by. It. Oh come on! Oh, uh. Oh shit. Okay. Manually designate the plants to cut. Then let's go that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. Why wouldn't let me change the storyteller? <laughs> yeah, you can't change the storyteller. Only I can change the storyteller. Um. Do you want to go like Cassandra Classic or something? Oh, we're only on Randy Medium. That's fine. Yeah, but Randy like throws hard shit at you there. early game. We're on Cassandra Medium now. No complaining. Fucking complain all I want, mate. Right. Is that all the... That should be all the blight gone now. Um, except for that one, which no one's cutting. Get rid of that plant. There we go. All right. We good? How are these trees growing so quickly? They're absurd, aren't they? They're ridiculous. It's because we're in a swamp. It's like exactly, funnily enough, the right climate for it. It's good for us too, but... In between harvest, it's going to be a pain in the ass, that's all. Especially if we get the tilled soil mod as well, which I'm still putting up for consideration, by the way. Um, right. Okay, so the, the the windmill's just not running enough for a single cooler, which is obviously bad news. Oh, it's minus nine in there, though. That's pretty great. Um, oh, shit. Right, critical. We've got corpses. I'll also put animal corpses in there, but not insect corpses. There we go. Nice. We should start moving all this stuff indoors as well as our next job. Um, we should probably also move the food in there ASAP. Uh, haul, please. Prioritize hauling. Thank you. Prioritize hauling rice. There we go. Oh, we got a chest right. table. When did you build that? Fucking components. Right, I have components already. No, no, I was just... What? Oh, I need to move components indoors. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Dick, dick, dick. I might even wake my boy up just to move this rice quickly. I had a game where I managed to get a full... It was 150 stack of components early game. Oh, shit. And then one of my guys had a mental break and set it a on fire. Ball. That's so good. Let's just say he was tied to a wall and shot. <laughs> <laughs> I've had a couple of death by firing squads in a couple of my campaigns. I forget what the last guy did, but it was in the Bonnet Bigley campaign. Was it just wearing Bonnet's hat? I think it was him. He wore Bonnet's crown. So he was <laughs> lined up and they all shot him with their magic. That was pretty fun. I love Room of Magic. I think it, I think it's a, a good <gasps> idea. Oh, shit. What was it? I just completely deleted it. Where Some it? chicken eggs. Oh, fertilized or unfertilized? Unfertilized. Blech. Boring. Well, I mean, it's food. We should probably haul those pretty quickly then. Yeah. I'll, I'll go grab those. There we go. Because that's at least some food eaten raw. It's good protein, you know. Get your protein on. <laughs> Nothing says good protein like, you know, chicken eggs you found in a swamp. Right. Let's get rid of the stockpile and just keep the indoor one going. Construction botched. Well done. Classic Joshk. 
really what, bad. What don't you fucking botch, honestly? Oh, we could probably do, do some light in here. Yeah, I was thinking that. We could probably put a floor wherever we can, but until we can get those moisture, we're going to be like, those moisture pumps. Those moisture? We're kind of limited in, uh, we're the opposite of Uncle Lars and Aunt Baru. We're like non-moisture farmers. We're, we're, we're dry farmers. <laughs> dry farmers. <laughs> Good dry harvest this season. All right, there we go. That's looking a little bit better. Yeah, it's gonna like the, the base is always just gonna be filled with filth as well because of you know the mud filth. everywhere. <gasps> Floor mats. You want to get the doormat mod? <laughs> okay, here's a new suggestion. <laughs> we add a mod each, and then a third mod which we both vote on. Okay. So you want to add fridge fridge i agree with yeah. the stack i think that's a good suggestion i didn't really have one in mind but next episode i'm, I'm gonna come up with one and stick to it despite what your your prattling and then what <laughs> so the third one doormats um it would save us having to clean all the fucking time it really would well i don't know that it would though um based on the fact that the base itself is going to be full of mud and there's nothing we can do about it yeah, it's true actually there might be a better one um do you want me to go How long to the have we left? been recording for? Oh, about 31 minutes, so we're going to end this episode here in a second. We're just going to come up with the next uh, the next mod. Uh, the final mod that we're going to add to next episode before we move into that one. Um, we could go with Joy Objects. That was one that you were sort of interested in. Um, uh, Dinosauria. <laughs> um, there's a one-way ticket of getting fucked. <laughs> we've got... Feed the Colonists for producing bulk meals. That's probably not a bad plan. Although this early on, it might not be the most. Oh yeah, thing. that's true. Uh, Mega fauna. More, more bridges because you can build those over mud. Oh, bridges is a good plan. Yeah. Are we are we good with bridges? Yeah. So for next time, we're gonna get ogre stack, um, whatever you want, rim fridge and bridges, and they are gonna be the first three mods in this. And hopefully, oh, should also probably say that we're gonna be recording these in bulk. Oh, absolutely, yeah. I, th I think that should be pretty obvious. Because I don't have as much free time as Samuel. I mean, this is my job, actually, so this is... Uh, I'm not, I don't have free time, Josh. You know what I mean. <laughs> yeah, we'll leave this one here. I think it's oh, Ambrosia Sprout. Look at that. That's something good to come back to next time. Well done, team. That's you. Your, your team. Yeah. And smash the pause button.